So, university. Big, dark, scary place. That's better. And being a Christian? Tough, right? Especially when you feel like you're on your own. So, what is IFES? As a new Christian, Mark wanted to be grounded in his faith and to see how God speaks in the Bible. So a staff worker started to meet with him each week. Together, they worked through the big picture of the Bible from Genesis to Revelation. Mark grew in faith very quickly. Today, he is reading the Bible with his friends, praying that they too will meet Jesus in the pages of the Bible and come to trust in him themselves. Students transformed by the gospel. This is IFES. In Peru, the students wanted to share their faith with the faculty and they asked how they could serve. The toilets hadn't been cleaned for so long that cleaning them took 48 hours. The dean saw how committed the students were to serve in the university. On the second day, he told the lecturers to join the students as they cleaned. Through this practical act of love, the students had opportunity to speak to the faculty and other students about their faith. Students proclaiming God's kingdom in word and in deed. This is IFES. After becoming a Christian, Derek moved back to Lusaka, the capital of Zambia, determined to develop student ministry there. The work grew rapidly and soon 10% of all university students in Zambia were Christians. The president of Zambia heard about the impact of Christians on the university. He wanted to know more about the message that was turning the university upside down. Derek explained how the good news of Jesus affects all of life. The president asked Derek to speak to his whole cabinet. This is what their culture needed to hear. Leaders of integrity impacting society. This is IFES. What happens when hardly anyone in your campus is a Christian? It takes courage to stand out as a follower of Christ. With the encouragement of his IFES group, Abdul decided that every semester he would choose a different non-Christian roommate so he could show someone close up what it means to be a Christian. Last year, thanks to Abdul's consistent witness, his roommate came to faith in Christ. God hasn't fully opened doors in every country, but he has opened windows. So students like Abdul can show the love of God to their fellow students in creative ways. Students boldly living out the Christian life. This is IFES.